I also think one of them died because there's a bit of snow. Yeah. Okay, enough with the morning. It's Christmas season. Hi guys and welcome back to the next episode of Harmony Hollow and today we are on the server because we are going to be decorating our house for Christmas. So I have my super cute Christmas skin on, it looks super adorable. I don't know, is there a Santa hat? Are those a thing? I mean if not I'll maybe put on like a fluffy hat. I'm just trying to find what is the most Christmassy hat. You know what, we'll go with the clip on Halo because Christmas and angels and things, but I look adorable. I love it. So, like any good Christmas decorating episode, we must have Christmas music. So we'll start the Christmas music in three, two, one. I have clap on Christmas music, guys, because I'm a professional. So, we now need to go over to the holiday section and get ourselves some cute things. I'm so ready for decorating. See, I love the big Christmas trees, but they take so much resources. <laughs> it's a heckin' lot. Like, look how much of clay that takes compared to everything else. I'm gonna make sure to grab some inside house things. Oh, I have a mantelpiece. Can I hang stockings on the mantelpiece? <gasps> can I, 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 can I? I can't. I've never been more distraught in my life. I'm gonna find a way. Give me a minute. Give me some blocks. Okay, so we do that. Then we get rid of this. And then we try the mantelpiece there. Aha! Look at that! I am amazing. You can send me your nominations for best Minecrafter. I will accept them. I do now need a new fire though because I have put it out. But look how adorable that is with the little stockings. Oh, I love it. It's so cute. Well, we don't need this because we're going to put a gingerbread house there. And then I didn't put anything else here since Halloween so I can decorate it. And then I need to get this big Christmas tree. And I have so much space in this house. Or at least like the outside area. And is this a Christmas tree you can run up? Oh my goodness, you can. I love it. It's great. I don't know how they built it, but it allows you to run up it like a cat. We'll put the sleigh out over here. This is like my Christmas house of dreams. This is what I want my in real life house to look like, but I don't think other people want my in real house to look like this. I'm looking at you, Jack and Shay, my housemates. Got snowman down, another snowman. Maybe one more round over here. Okay, cute. What else have we got? There's Christmas lights, which if I'm correct are adorable. I was correct, they are adorable. Look at that. And I can just do them around the house. And then I'm going to forget about them when it comes to like taking all the stuff down. And then hate myself for it. And before I end Harmony Hollow just because I can't be bothered taking down my Christmas decorations. And then I think I'm just going to grab like a mix of presents. Varying amounts and varying sizes. So I do have this tiny little Christmas tree that I hate. It's too small. This upsets me. I can't fit a normal Christmas tree in here, can I? There's Christmas tree. There's small Christmas tree. Will you fit? The answer was no. No, it won't. What about... Nope, still not going to fit in here. It might fit in my attic because that's exactly where everyone wants their Christmas tree. You know what? I'll put some presents down out here. Spruce it up a little so it's not just a random tree. It's as though someone couldn't be bothered getting the Christmas decorations down from the attic. So they were like, you know what? We'll just set them up upstairs. It's fine. I'm going to put the little reindeer there. We'll pop Santa over here. And then the little elf can go up in the mantelpiece because it'll be like elf on the shelf. I've got some bells, which will look adorable like there. Some mistletoe, which will look adorable there. And she come in, you can just go over a little kiss. <laughs> I have no one to kiss because I'm alone forever. We'll pop one right there, we'll pop one right there. I've got more presents, but I do have a giant tree out here to place the presents around. I'm very much a strategic decorator, as in I decorate the side that you're going to see. It's so like I put down the presents here because no one's ever walking around this side of the tree. It's like, you know when you decorate the tree and there's always one prettier side than the other and you put that one facing forward and the ugly side to the back? That's me when it comes to decorating. Get an advent wreath. We'll get some tinsel with blue baubles. And maybe we'll put some tinsel in my bedroom. Oh, we'll put the menorah on one side and we'll put the advent on the other. Look at that. Boom. Multicultural. You're welcome. I'm going to put some baubles like that. This advent wreath can go here. And who doesn't want a nativity scene? They, apparently everything doesn't want a nativity scene there. What about here? 
Where does the nativity scene even fit? There! The kitchen loves a nativity scene. You've got the cow and the pig and the baby Jesus. Look at the little baby Jesus. And then there's the angel that's given Joseph the hot eyes. Mary, you should be watching out for that angel because like, I don't remember that part of the nativity, but yeah, no. Maybe pop some Christmas lights in here as well. And then in the morning, we will go and grab ourselves some snow to make some snowmen and decorate the area properly because it does make it look so much better when there is snow. And luckily for me, I live very close to a nice snow area. Okay, that's hopefully enough snow at the moment. We will go and get ourselves pumpkins. Wait, do I have pumpkins? <gasps> I don't think I have pumpkins. I've never made pumpkins. I'm shook. I'm sure Nicola will have done pumpkins. You know, looking around this entire area, not seeing a pumpkin. Someone has opened a lot of lucky blocks though. Do you happen to have any pumpkins? I'm going to take some pumpkin seeds. Thank you. Love you. It's the season of giving. Don't be mad. Okay, do I have any bone? Oh, I have plenty of bones. Oh, and I have four pumpkins. Okay. Turns out I did not need to steal. I mean, I'm not saying I'm going to give those back, but turns out I didn't need to. Right. We'll pop the pumpkin seeds down, get our bone meal, perfecto. And while we wait for that to grow, I can go and make a bunch of snowmen. And by a bunch, I mean four, because that's all I have. And I need to make sure to shut my door, because otherwise they will go in. Okay, one, two, three. One more pumpkin, which we will do with this one. Okay, you know who might have pumpkins? Marielle might have pumpkins. I also need to repair my wings. For magic wings, they break a lot. Oh, it's gonna cost how much? 32 levels to repair them? Jesus, jubilee. We don't have enough for that. That's a Christmas ripoff. Okay, Marielle does have some pumpkins. This is great. And I'm not stealing because they will grow back. You know what, we'll also go and see if Jack had any. It's not like he's here anymore. I also don't feel like that'll be something that someone will have taken. A one pumpkin. And one of our snow golems will be remembered as they were Jack's pumpkin. Also, there's a bunch of TNT here and I really want to blow up his house. I won't, but I'm thinking about it. I wonder if Callum has any. I mean, again, stupid question. It's Callum, but he seems like the type that would pick up stuff and then just keep it for the sake. Oh, he has 11. Now he has two. And a pile of dead. You know what? I don't want to know. Right. One pumpkin, two pumpkin. Three pumpkin, four pumpkin. I'm getting good at this. I'm mastering the art of putting it on as I, I say that, as I miss. But what I was saying was I'm mastering the art of putting them on as I fall because I am a top tier pumpkineer. Oh my goodness, that rhymed and I love it. Can I get hashtag top tier pumpkineers in the chat please guys? Thanks. And by chat, I mean comment section. Okay, have you grown? No. Does extra bone meal aid in this? No. Would there be any pumpkins over where I opened the lucky blocks? I mean, we can go and have a look, I suppose. I am seeing a lot of things, but a pumpkin is not one of them. Okay, what I think I could do though, even though I can't do the pumpkins at the moment, I could put a nice Santa hat onto my house. Because I mean, I've been doing Santa hats for basically everything else I've ever done that's Christmassy. I mean, is it really Christmas if it doesn't have a giant Santa hat? The answer is no. So we'll make a bunch of rose red. We've got white wool and we'll do the trim first and then we will do the red. Now I don't want this to be too big, mainly because I do not have the supplies. I'm mad that my wings broke because they would be very handy. Okay, that's the white and then the rest just needs to be redified. Okay, I think I kind of have the shape. I do just need a lot more red wool though. And then I'm gonna use the snow to not do that. Can I launch myself up there? Eh. No, I can't. I've done a fall. I've got soggy. My fur's all wet. This is not what I wanted. Okay, how does this look? Oh, that looks cute. I mean, definitely not in proportion, but cute nonetheless. Okay, pumpkins, I've had enough of this. Come on, get it together. I only need like two more of you. Just two. I'm not asking for a whole lot. You know what I need to do and I forgot about until right this second and I can already tell a bunch of you have written it in the comment section already but I've got to go and shear them and make it so they're snowmen. Pup, they're so derpy and cute. I wish you got the pumpkins back though but I suppose you don't because it'd be an unlimited source of snow films. I mean I don't quite see how that would come in too much use but that might be why. I also think one of them died because there's a bit of snow. Yeah. 
<laughs> okay, enough with the morning. It's Christmas season. We've got to get into the mood. Back onto the Christmas music. Okay, I don't think there's really much else needed. Because the decor inside is super cute and Christmassy. We have a super cute outside, super cute and Christmassy. And the pumpkins. Oh, one's gone. I was about to bad talk them, but they heard. Well, I mean, you, I won't bad mouth. The rest of you are slacking. Poor little Pamela's never going to turn into a snow golem. She's never going to make it. Hashtag rest in peace, Pamela. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Harmony Hall. We managed to make it super cute. Let me know if there's anything you would change in my decor, anything you would add, anything I should add, because it will still be Christmas by the time the next episode's out. So I can maybe do some tweaks and changes and add things to it. But let me know in the comment section down below. Let me know what you're excited for about Christmas. Remember to subscribe if you're new to the channel, hit the notification bell so you do not miss a video, and I will see you all next time. Bye.